All right, so we're going to set up a HTTP web uh, folder for, uh, let's see, uh, we got to come up with a new marketing. Uh, we did marketing. Who should we do this time? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Who? The deli? Okay. So I'm going to log in as student. First, I'm going to open up uh, just a terminal window. Log in as super user. And the first thing we want to do is create the group Delhi. <clears throat> and they want to add users to the Delhi. Be sure to use option M to create the home folder for the new users. <clears throat> Usernames have to have begin with a lowercase letter. Option G adds the user to the group. In this case, the group is Delhi. So we've created a new group, Delhi. Created two users, added them to the Delhi group. Let's go make a directory for the Delhi, uh, and we're going to put it in the SRV folder. So I'm going to make the directory Delhi uh, in the SRV folder. I can do it even though I'm currently in the student's home folder, logged in as super user. As long as I use an absolute path, I can make the folder from anywhere. <coughs> All right, now I want to change the group assignment uh, to Delhi for that folder. because I want Tammy and Hannah to be able to make changes to this folder. And then I want to change the permissions on that folder. There. <clears throat> so here's the Delhi folder. The Delhi group has been assigned to it. And the group permissions are read, write, execute. And let's go into be asked and set up the web server to host our new folder. <clears throat> okay, so it's the web server's turned on. It's listening on all IP addresses on port 80. We'll go to the main host tab. And we want to change our document root directory to this new Delhi folder. Right. Then we also want to change the directory options. We'll change that to Delhi. And finish that, and it should restart. So now our web service is going to host files from a different directory. It's going to host files from the Delhi. Okay, the next thing we need to do is create a password for the users. create one for the other user. All right, so now I'm going to log in as one of the Delhi users. All right, I'm logged in as user Hannah. She's a Delhi member and we'll go to the Delhi folder. We're going to create a new document. And now we'll edit that. And because Anna is a member of the Delhi, she is able to create and change files 
in this folder. So now if we open up a browser, let's see if it'll host the page. Yeah. Uh.